Eight Things You Should Know Before Adopting a Yorkshire Terriers Hello everyone and welcome to today's video. Today we'll be discussing something near and dear to many people's hearts. Yorkshire Terriers Yorkshire Terriers are adorable, loyal, and one of the most popular breeds of dogs. But there are some things you should consider before adopting one. They have specific needs and require a lot of care and attention. In this video, we'll discuss what you should think about before deciding to add a Yorkshire Terrier to your family. So, let's get started. 1. It is very active. Do not be fooled by their small size and innocent eyes. Yorkshire Terriers are far more energetic than any other dog. They love to run around the house and enjoy playing with their owners. You must take them on daily walks to give them the opportunity to have fun. If you do not, they will start to feel depressed. 2. His coat needs a lot of care. The Yorkshire Terrier's beautiful fur needs to be brushed each day or else it will become matted. For this reason, many of these dogs are bred with shorter hair to make grooming easier. Additionally, the ears and other parts of the body need to be taken care of on a regular basis by a professional groomer. 3. It barks a lot. A Yorkshire Terrier is a loyal dog that will stand up for its home if provoked. If loud barking is an issue for you or your neighbors, you have to use effective training techniques to teach the dog proper behavior or else the barking will become unmanageable. 4. Your size doesn't usually matter. No visitor or sound at the door will go undetected by these miniature guardians. It is important to begin training your puppy early to make sure that both his barking and his energetic behavior do not become unmanageable for you and your family. 5. Not so ideal for children. A Yorkshire Terrier is not the best pet for a home with babies or young kids due to their size. Kids can be too rough or move too quickly towards the dog, which can lead to serious harm. This can make the Yorkie distrustful of small children and sometimes even cause it to growl at them. If you have children and bring a Yorkie into your home, you should always make sure to keep an eye on them when they are around the dog. 6. He usually acts like a human baby. A Yorkshire Terrier is similar to a human baby in that it requires a lot of attention. It will need to be held by you whenever you are going somewhere. He will nap for extended periods and act out when not being given sustenance. In addition, it has a tendency to make messes, so it would not be unusual to find dirt on your bedding, in the kitchen, or on furniture. 7. It's hard to educate. It is not surprising that Yorkshire Terriers are ranked second on the list of the 16 most challenging breeds to train. This is likely due to their stubborn nature, which makes it difficult to break them of bad habits once they have become accustomed to them. Secondly, Yorkshire Terriers walk close to the ground, making them reluctant to go outside in wet or snowy weather. On the other hand, a bigger, taller breed of dog can traverse wet grass or snow without any trouble. To train a Yorkie in the home environment requires commitment and perseverance, as even the most stubborn may eventually learn to go out to do their business or not bark at any sound. 8. He does not like cold or humidity. We have already informed you that Yorkshire Terriers are not fond of cold and humid weather conditions, so much so that they may not even be willing to step on wet streets or the chilly ground in December. This can be problematic when it comes to training them. However, it is important to use only positive reinforcement methods such as rewards and affection, and above all, be patient. In conclusion, adopting a Yorkshire Terrier is a big decision, and there are a lot of things to consider. Make sure you have the time and energy to commit to a Yorkie, have a budget in place, and have a suitable living situation. If you think you can handle all of these things, then a Yorkie may be the perfect pet for you. Thanks for watching and we hope you found this video helpful. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comments section below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.